Walsingham School in my constituency has been forced to suspend its sixth form, a result of years of cuts to post-16 education by this ruthless government, and a national funding formula which discriminates against smaller rural communities and their schools. The Education Secretary has washed his hands of the issue, and as a result, people in my community, young people, will face four hours of more journey just for, just for education. Walsingham is the first to face this crisis, but six forms across the country will collapse under the current funding situation. Will the Prime Minister intervene to help our schools, but the broader network of six forms and six form colleges too? Well, can I say to the Honourable Lady that uh, I'm pleased that she's raised the issue of Walsingham. I well remember Walsingham from the time when I stood uh, in uh, the North West Durham seat. But the government is spending... The government is spending... Yes, I wasn't successful there, but... I hope it's not being suggested that that is some sort of savage personal indictment of the Prime Minister. It probably wasn't very propitious territory at the time. The Prime Minister. Can I say to the Honourable Lady, I understand the decision to suspend recruitment to Walsingham School Sixth Form was actually made by the school governing body after the student numbers fell in recent years, um, and that there are other good and outstanding school sixth forms and colleges available within travelling distance of Weardale. Some young people already are choosing to access those rather than the local school sixth form. But the local authority is looking at the question of future travel arrangements. That is a responsibility that they have in relation to post-16 travel. Transport, and our new national funding formula for pre-16 school funding will indeed help to safeguard rural schools uh, and by ensuring that we do have uh, a more appropriate funding formula across the country and there's a lump sum in respect of every school and additional support for small rural schools.